DNS stands for Domain Name Server. It is always a good practice to change the default domain name server provided by your ISP. But before we do that, let us see what is DNS in detail. Computers need an IP address to communicate. When you type google.com in your browser, the first step, the browser will connect with the DNS server. It will ask what is the equivalent IP address for google.com. And the DNS server has all the translations between all the IP address and all the domains available in the internet. It is a big repository. The DNS server will respond back saying google.com is hosted at this particular IP address. And once we get this response from the DNS server, the second step is our uh, browser will send a request to the web server which is hosted at this particular IP address. And uh, the web server will then send back the uh, relevant web page to our uh, browser. So to summarize, DNS is like a middleman. DNS will have all the, all the domains available uh, in the internet as well as the IP address they are hosted at. But why do you have to change the DNS server? The first and foremost reason is the security. Using an unsafe DNS can spoof you and lead you into phishing attacks. The second reason is privacy. You don't want your DNS server to store all your browsing history. We need a DNS server that respects your privacy and uh, that doesn't store any of your browsing logs. And uh, the third reason is the speed. We are going to use the DNS from Cloudflare. Cloudflare is the fastest DNS server available today. In fact, it is faster than Google DNS and it's even faster than the Open DNS. Considering the security, the privacy, and the speed, switching to the Cloudflare DNS from your uh, default uh, ISP provided DNS is a no-brainer. To change the default DNS server for your home network, you will need to log in to your uh, routers management portal. Type in your routers IP address and then log into your router. And once you log into your router, your router's welcome screen might be different than this based on the router model that you are using. But uh, you can go ahead and check uh, all the options available in your uh, router management portal. And then you can stumble upon the section where uh, you can find the DNS settings. So for my router, the DNS settings are present in the connectivity tab and then in the local network. So if you notice here, there is a place where I can enter the DNS server name. So here I have mentioned my DNS server name as 1111, which is the DNS server of uh, Cloudflare. So you can even use uh, the other DNS servers like OpenDNS or Google DNS, but uh, Cloudflare DNS is uh, proven to be faster and uh, it also reduces the number of ads that you see. Uh, and they also respect your privacy. They don't store any of your data. And uh, once you change the DNS settings here, just go ahead and uh, hit apply. Your router might take a while to reflect these changes. And then you can log out from your router management portal. Now that we have changed the default uh, DNS server, let us go ahead and verify if, if my internet queries are actually using Cloudflare DNS. To do that, search Google for Cloudflare DNS checker and you will see the official uh, DNS checker from Cloudflare. Hit o open it and then you will see a link to test your browser. Click on it and then if you notice here, uh, it says we have detected you are using 1.1.1.1. From now on, all the queries from my browser will be routed to Cloudflare DNS.